this is the uh, setup of the Holy Sacrament. Like my sister Kathy and I, we sometimes we, well, often we try to get together because the Bible says in the New Testament that we often should get together and uh, take at the Holy Supper. Uh, as you can see, I have the, um, we have the, uh, the uh, miraculous medal here of Mary. So you can see Mary right here, and around her, on the edge, all around the edge, it says, Mary, can see without sin, pray for us, what's recourse to thee. You see the words? Right there, around the edge, uh, uh, going around the uh, oval, inner edge. And of course, in the back of it, we have the, um, a large M for Mary, the cross, and we have, of course, um, Two hearts here, okay. One was pierced with a sword, but that, but the thing about it is that um, it's good to always take the body of Christ and the blood of Christ, because the Bible says in New Testament it says right there, in black and white. We have to we have to get together often, and take it now. Why? Because the word the way the world the world is today, the temptations, the violence, um, the anxiety that we should always uh, have God to be with us in Jesus. Now, if you notice, I have the rosary here, because Kathy and I, we, we do pray the rosary. See right here? Here's the rosary. Kathy has her rosary, but she put it away. We already blessed the sacrament, um, and uh, it's over. Okay? Uh, that's how it is. Now, this is the dish in two glass that I, that I got uh, from a certain store. In order to do the, uh, we put the bread here, and we bless the bread. You put the water here and bless the water. We bless the bread and say this is no longer bread. And then the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. And now this is the body of Christ. We take the water and we say, uh, and I say in each cup, and the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. This is no longer, this is no longer a, a cup of water, but the blood of Christ. And the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. This is no longer the water, but the body, but the blood of Christ. And so, the, so you have the body of Christ, and we have the blood of Christ. Okay, now first, before we, 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 before we take the uh, sacrament, the first thing we do is we do the rosary. We do the rosary. Depending on what day and what mysteries, we say the rosary first. And pray for, for our intentions. And then afterwards, we go and we, do, we take the sacrament. This is how the setup is. We do this often um, because, um, because the, uh, the devil is around. Uh, destroying things. The devil's like a roar, roaring lion devour, devouring um, whoever he sees. It's in the scriptures. Just read the scriptures. So we know that we need protection and we need love and we need and to understand that this is uh, all prophecy coming true. All this stuff coming true, is, uh, all these uh, destructions, effort destructions, evil, um, all this stuff. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's biblical. So we use biblical methods to overcome it. So we do a rosary. We, do, we take out the sacrament. We, we read scriptures. We do good works. Because the devil hates when you do all these things. Okay? And we preached. And we teach. So we do this often. And we get strength. And we have God's spirit to be with us always. Um... So, maybe you should try this. You know, once in a while, get together. You, by yourself, or with others. Now, remember what the Bible says, the New Testament. When two or more are gathered together, there I shall be. But still, if you're alone, you can still do this. And God will always be with you. But there you go. All right? Okay. Just let you know. Bye-bye, and have a good day. God bless all of you. Amen.